And where was it? Was it, was it a, a Muslim hospital? The, well, Muslims don't have hospitals, do they? Well, I don't know if they do, but... Why don't they we... shouldn't, really. Why don't Muslims have hospitals? Well, if you, if you listen to my wing commander, who used to tell me what they used to do, and that, you know, from the minute you were 3.2 fucking seconds old, you were being trained and primed to strap yourself up with explosives or fireworks or anything, you know, fucking Catherine wheels, some of them, you know, they're really poor psycho bombers. And um, they just run into town hall with fucking Catherine wheels <laughs> flirting all over them. And I'm like, oh, leave him, maybe all right. These people don't need hospitals because their idea is that they're going to go in complete and fucking limbs are going to, what do Billy Connolly call them? Flying mints. Excellent. But, um, well, like, you know, I'm going on a, a suicide mission, but keep the A&E up until midnight just in case. <laughs> right. Doesn't make sense, does it? So I don't know what it was, actually. It was either an orphanage or an old folks home. But you know, they're so poor over there when the kids are about this big. They, they morph into old men. It was like being in a fucking ward of Edward G. Robinson's. It was weird.